Blake Parker, and today I'm going to be talking to you about how to properly weight train. To start off, here are five benefits of weight training. You have injury prevention to help you to not pull a muscle. It can help prevent type 2 diabetes. It relieves stress. It burns calories, and it can give you a healthier heart. Weight training is a type of strength that uses weights to provide a stress to the muscle, causing the muscle to get stronger. Here are some types of weight trainings that you can use. You have barbells and dumbbells, resistant bands, your own body weight, and weight machines. Each of these are a great way to start weight training. Your local gym should have these. Proper weight training techniques. Here are a few that you need to know before going to the gym. You should always warm up five to 10 minutes before each workout to prevent any injuries to your body, as in pulling a muscle. Do not arc your back when lifting. You wanna stand as straight as you can and not be arced over like this, as it could pull something in your lower back. Do not start with a heavy weight. Start small, and as you progress and you can see that you're gaining progress in your weight, work your way up to those heavier weights. You can cause a major injury by Breathe properly during each lift. If you can focus on your breathing, it can help prevent an injury if you can stay focused on what you're lifting. Here's a picture of how to properly lift whenever you deadlift. As you can see, his back is perfectly straight out and he has one hand wrapped around the bar and another one up under the bar and he's gonna keep his back straight as he goes down and he's gonna lift that up. The next picture that I'm going to show you is how to properly squat. As you can see, he had, in this top picture, he has his elbows flared out like this. You want your elbows to be parallel with your torso, and you want to kind of look down about five to six feet. You don't want to be looking up when you're going down, as that can cause another injury. Here's a picture of how to properly bench press. Whenever you bench press, make sure that you have a spotter behind you so that you can make sure that you don't get restless whenever you're bench pressing. I found this picture off of a strengthblog.com and this is a great website to go to in case you need any tips. It can show you how to do all of these proper lifts without causing yourself an injury. There's many videos to watch as well. Why should you weight lift? Well, stronger muscles can improve your posture so that you can stand straight up more. Toning your muscles lead to a body shape. Weightlifting promotes a leaner, less fat body mass. And it can improve your mental as well as your physical health. Those are the two main reasons that people go to the gym, so that they can relieve stress and improve their mental health. How can you get started going to the gym? You need to set aside one to two hours each day per week to go to the gym. You need to work out only one or two muscle groups per visit and set realistic goals to reach. You don't want to have something really high that you can't achieve. And whenever you've reached that, or if you can't reach that, it's going to discourage you and it's going to cause you to quit going. You should join a gym or you can work out at home. Going to a gym has many benefits though. You can go to your local hometown gym and they will show you, a lot of gyms will show you how to use these weights and they have affordable memberships to start you out to see if you're going to stick with it. Thank you and I hope you have learned a lot about how to properly lift weights.